Hey guys, D Mike here for another episode of Super Mario Galaxy 2. Last time we did a little bit of a nostalgic trip through some childhood memories, at least for me. So today we're gonna start off with the battle belt. Let's see what this prankster comet has in store for us. Mmm. See what we got. We're kind of doing a whole cocktail of things today. We're gonna do the mini planet daredevil run. Okay. This one I think kind of speaks for itself. You have to essentially do all the things we did last time, and you can take zero damages. So you gotta be careful. Self-preservation is a key. Yes. I thought it was gonna be jerk and time it as well. I almost <laughs> immediately failed. That would have been funny, right? If you guys are enjoying this content, please continue to like these videos and subscribe if you haven't. Subscriber count is going up. Appreciate that, everybody. It lets me know that you're enjoying the content and you're following along. Helps me to figure out what stuff you vibe with, what you'd like to see more of. So don't hesitate to do that. It's incredibly important. It might not seem like it, but it does really help the channel. And it makes me appreciate you guys all the more. So, yeah. Thanks everybody that has subscribed. If you haven't, please do so as soon as possible. We've got some big things in store for the future, so... Hold on to your butts. So far... So good. Ooh. I didn't even think about this. Come on, I feel this blue one. Oh, no. This level is kind of whatever, but the music of this galaxy is so good. Come here, Bluey. Mr. Pianchers. Oh, excuse me, sir. Oh, oh, oh. He's like, I don't want you to get me. I don't want you to get me. Oh, I'm going to get you. I don't remember how I got him last time, but I'm going to figure it out. Oh, that should have counted. Come on. Ooh. I just want to I just want to slap your buns. He's a He's a shifty boy. Oops. <laughs> I guess running right into him is not the key to success. Oops. Oh, is this going to be one of those? Uh, well, at least this will be an opportunity to get a metric butt ton of Star bits, I know that. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to be pretty careful on this one. Oof. <laughs> that was close. I have a feeling that doing this one more than maybe once or twice is gonna be relatively soul sucking. And that's not the sucking that I'm into, so. No! <laughs> Come on. They ganged up on me. Not cool. Yeesh. Hang in there, everybody. This is a potentially bumpy ride. Get over here. Also, why have the two different species of Goombas never been addressed? Are they from different universes? Okay. This one's gonna take some patience. Just gotta be careful. Take your time. Take some deep breaths. In and out. Little did you know, the d -Mike place is also a front for mental health help. So there you go. That's my advice. When in doubt, take some deep breaths. Unless you're underwater, and then maybe don't do that. Okay, so if these spiky boys could vacate the vicinity here, they do give out a ton- oh, I got him. I did not got him. Until now. But I need to hurry because using the fire flower on the crabs... Very helpful. Yes! Oh, I missed. There we go. That's a speedrunning strat. If I ever saw one, you're welcome. You gotta cook your crabs. You don't want to eat raw seafood. I don't even know if people eat crab raw. I know that's kind of a thing for, like, sushis and stuff. Which I did learn 
you know, when people talk about sushi, they refer to, you know, the entire dish, right? When in reality, sushi is actually just in reference to the rice that's used. It's a vinegared rice that is made as part of the dish. So the sushi itself, all, all things that have raw fish are not sushi. It's based on the rice involved. So there you go. Which is funny that I say that. I don't have a ton of knowledge about sushi, but I just know that I'm not really a huge fan of it. The idea of it kind of weirds me out a little bit. The only thing that I want to eat raw is the uh, tears of my enemies. Okay, so this seems horrible. Let's see if I can just kind of go around the outside. Around the oops, around the outside. Around the outside. Okay, this is going to be kind of tricky. Oop. Whoa. Excuse me, nunchuck. I was not ready for that. Whoa. These controls are a little, a little wonky. No. Yeah, this is. This is one of the ones that you just really don't want to have to do ad nauseum. There's just a whole lot of shenaniganery. I'm like, <laughs> like tense right now playing this game. I'm so nervous. All right. Oh, there's a checkpoint. Bless you. Okay, so we got more of these Whatever these things are, I don't care for them, but they don't care for me either, so it's fair that you have to knock them out wh whilst I ice skating. It's really hard to say. Oof, okay, I think we're almost done. Got some Monty Moles here. We will unearth them from just trying to do their job and live their lives, and we're just kind of ruining their day. That's fine. I don't know how much more of this there is. I know that there's a little subsection with the Topmans. Ooh. Oh no. No, no. No. Oh boy. Oh, I'm so scared. Alright, so... This boy... Oh no. Oh, no. oh man. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I am sweating profusely right now. Okay. Everything is fine. And last but not least, our worst enemy. Gigantic Bat Wows. Okay, here we go. Remember the rules, everybody. You gotta kill them with these with these gigantic boogers. Use your land boogers to slap your balls and achieve great success. There we go. And all of those star bits into whoa. I really like the design of this planet. Planetoid, whatever this is. Yes. That looks like a successful run, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Pat yourselves in the back for a first try. Boom. Nice. Excellent work, everybody. Successful run. Feels pretty good. Well, it took, you know, a third of the video for one star. Nice, fun. Battle Belt Galaxy Prankster complete. Okay. Still don't really know exactly how much left there is to do in some of these areas. I've already seen a star in here that I really don't want to do. Um, this is going to be absolutely horrible. I have a feeling. I feel it in my blooms. Here we go. It is the Follow Me Mr. bob -omb. I don't exactly know what this one means. I thought I, I thought I did it right the first time. Oh, it's the same music again. So if you didn't enjoy it the first time, well, you're probably not going to enjoy it this time either. But I don't know. It had the gear mo. 
icon on it, which means that they're gonna want to enlist our help to enslave other creatures, I'm assuming. But I could be wrong. Which, you know, that does happen on occasion. Here d -Mike plays. Modesty is the best commodity. Okay, here we go. We're gonna keep traveling through. This is where we picked up the Comet Medal, if you all remember. There it is. In its former glory. It was a little bit tricky to grab, but we did manage it eventually. Take a leap of faith here. Whoa! No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Just, guys, once again, deep breaths. It's fine. Everything is fine. Now, I don't think the Girmo appears until the final subsection. So, I'm gonna pop over there. This is the one where we had to lure the Goomba. Oh, okay. Bob bomb just kind of killed itself. That's not cool. All right. This is kind of trippy. Because you're trying to be mindful of the electric spaghetti here that's constantly trying to kill you. All right, here we go. Boom. Get yourself the life shroom. Increase your odds of success. Unless you're me. And then that really doesn't do anything. Okay, here we go. Let's continue on. Break out of our captivity here. All right. Some some topmans to deal with, of course. If you remember here, and we have the Bob-omb that we can flick away, like picking our nose. Excuse me, Mr. Topman. Gotcha. Just a little one. Okay. So I guess you don't really need to do that at all. You can just move on with your day. Wait. Oh. You thought. You thought. No! You thought. Hey, you. Oh, wait. Here we go. Here's the top. Or the gear moat we need to talk to. A free lunch. This guy doesn't want to talk about free lures. He wants you to pick yourself up by your bootstraps. Okay, here we go. So it looks like we're in the neighborhood of... Gathering a red topman, which I imagine might help to... Oh, there's permanently reproducing yellow ones. It's very annoying. So I don't like them. I don't care for you. I don't care for your kind. All right, stop. All right, so where is the... Man, you gotta... You're gonna have to continually dispatch the bob bombs. Deal with the yellow ones. The red one is way over here. I'm trying to aggro the red one is a little... Whoa! No, don't you do it. Come on. Come on, bud. Yeah, this is uh, kind of miserable. Whoa! No! Come on. Nope. Come on, red boy. Let's go! I don't have time for these kind of shenanigans. Let's go! Let's bring it around town. Yes, so far so good. Don't let your your little yellow brethren send you astray. Oh boy. No, no! <laughs> Ugh, I was doing much more better than last time. I mean, there wasn't really a last time. This is my first time doing this, but... Okay, so I don't know... I feel like I probably have to trigger the Gearmo at some point, but maybe I can just bring the red one with me preemptively, potentially. I don't know. Stop it. All right, so I think we do need to, you do need to clear a little bit of a pathway. It seems, man, these yellow ones are, oh, they're really grinding my gears. Really making me, spinning me out of control here. Come on, brother, let's go. Yeah, it's really tough because they don't, the time in between Luma spinning... Did you fall off the edge now? Okay, here we go. Get over here. No! <laughs> That's a very tight... Very tight little window you gotta... Work yourself through. Okay. Oh, there's two red ones. Okay, here we go. Double your odds. Double your flavor. Oops. I didn't mean to do that. 
Let's go. Yeah, it's the, the little yellow ones. They're very aggressive. Kind of rude. Need a maybe MYOB. Mind your own business. All right. Come on, fella. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. Stop. Stop. Oh, no. I'm going to need you to quit it. I wish I could just use the bob bomb to... No, no. Don't you do it. Okay. Oh, pfft. <laughs> I'm not even entirely sure that hit me. All right, come on. I'm trying to... We're trying to boogie here. You're not... You're not playing playing along with the music. Here we go. Now, you could probably walk a tightrope that way. If you were feeling dangerous. It is kind of tough to get this... Oh, did I just kill it? I did. <laughs> well, that's... It's good that there's two of them. I don't know if the red ones infinitely respawn as well, but... Yeah, this, uh... This mission is definitely top five in the fun category, if I had to say so myself. They definitely do a good job of making this one a, a one that uh, deserves a return visit. If you're, you know, just hanging out and want something to do that's not the worst, you come to, to the Topman Galaxy, whatever this one's called. All right. I can get your cousins to leave me alone. Come on. Here we go. We're so close. Okay. So Mr. Bootstrap's here. All right. Please tell me this counts. You're right. What, what are we missing here? I don't, I don't understand. Is this not what you said you wanted? No. <laughs> Well, about that. Mmm. Okay, well. Justice was served. These are some long stars. It's gonna be a, a longer episode. Okay. Starting off on the uh, right top. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Come on. It's coming in hot. Spin me around, baby. Okay. Yeah, you just gotta kind of kite the little yellow ones around. Where did the red one go? There you go. Come on. Let's just sneak right past them. Let's just sneak. Let's just sneak right past them. There we go. Okay. Oof. No, stop. Don't. Do not. Come on. Why is aggroing you so hard? Come on. No. Come on. Come on. You have one, one, one thing that you do. Don't stop. Well, do stop. Where did he go? Come here. Come on, brother. You're making me look bad. I thought that I did it right. I don't know what I did wrong. Like, I brought him into the into the queue here. I put him in line. Alright. Maybe I just gotta kill all the little yellow ones first. Come on. We're almost there. Yeah, they're just like permanently trying to murder me. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Yeesh. Yeah. You're welcome. I feel like that was deserving of more than one star. That was brutal. Yeesh. Let's get out of here. That was painful. Physically painful. Okay. So far, so good. We're just going to move on with our day. We're not going to complain about it. Be thankful. We get the opportunity to murder little spinning tops. Helps to get rid of the PTSD from when we played with Beyblades as a kid. Now we get the silver and the gold Guillermo. The Guillermo family is complete? Maybe? Where are you? What kind of nonsense do you have to say about capitalism? Oh my gosh. 
Is that a government handout from a Gearmo? What is happening? Okay. So we got two more stars to do today, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna zoom out. We could do, yeah. Uh, I definitely do not want to do. I'm not doing that Fluzzard star today. I refuse. So we can wrap that up next time. We'll do. We'll do the Boom Bunker. Prankster, I bet this is gonna be a Daredevil Comet. You know I love those. Oh boy. Pick up your telephones, ladies and gentlemen, because I called it. I don't remember this being too bad. My only fear is that getting there is going to be a pain in the butt. Because it is this was a pretty tricky star to approach. You know, starting with having to break. Break the dome. Oh, we almost did it. Nope. <laughs> well, wouldn't you know it? I don't want to say I told you so, but hmm. <laughs> hey, hey, Captain Toad, I'm gonna need you to to dial it back about 20% right now. You're kind of uh, kind of being a bit of a menace. Okay. That's a first try. Let's move along, shall we? And a boop. Ah, it looks like a little a little off target. Yes, it certainly was. Oof. Yeah, we gotta be careful for these boomerang boys. Whoa, okay. Wouldn't be a boomerang if it didn't come back. I love it. I do like that they use the set design from the previous kind of Bowser Jr. mech as the way that you do this. That's kind of a nice touch. That is way off target. <laughs> okay, so that one counted, but the last one did not. Oof. Not quite sure I understand that. All right, let's keep moving. Two little slapperoos. Whoa. Nope. Okay. These Daredevil comments are basically a lesson in self-preservation, so you just gotta be very mindful. It's actually one of the core tenets of Buddhism, mindfulness, and this is actually one of the premier applications of said mantra. The Buddhist religion often plays Super Mario Galaxy 2 when they're trying to improve their mindfulness. Oh, please. Okay. <laughs> oh, I didn't know that happened. Jeez. You just disintegrate into the goo? That's devastating. Okay. I would like to not spend forever doing this star. I guess I just decided to pick three that are going to be... Oh, whew, I died. Three that are kind of more of an above average pain in the buns. Where did that... I saw a bullet bill. Where did it go? Oh, there we go. Okay, we'll use this one. The long jumping is good. It creates a little bit of separation. So you can jump to the dome. Boom. And if you hit the target, which I am very capable of doing, gives you that one up. First try, of course. No doubt about it. Oh. Oh. Oh, we like... What is that sound they're making? Bah! If you could stop, quit. It's annoying that they have two, though. I don't quite understand. Oh, that was cool. A little jump kick. When in doubt, jump kick it out. Oink. Got him. See ya. Okay. So let's be more careful this time around. And it's not Valentine's Day, viewers, but would you be mine? Here we go. So this platform, it looks like you have to kind of lead your shot. It's going to come back at some point. Avoid the mines. Let's 
see if that's enough. Looks pretty good. Boom! That's a bullseye. That's the eye of the bull. Eye of the tiger. Here we go. Ooh, I don't remember this being part of the, the level. Is this something that we had to do last time? I don't remember this. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, this is horrible. I do not remember this. There is way too much goo for me to be comfortable with this. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a checkpoint, though. Okay, so... It looks like they decided to sort of... make this a little bit of a different challenge, an alternative path? I was not expecting that. But here at Demike Industries, we pride ourselves on expecting the unexpected. So here we go, Boomsday Machine round two. Bowser Jr. once again very proud of himself, like we didn't just murder him last time. It would have been cool if they could have changed up the interaction slash dialogue a little bit. Now I don't remember the first wave of this being too difficult. My memory's a little cloudy, but I think in general it wasn't too bad. Okay. Need to see if we can snag one of these cloud power-ups while we're being costed by these fire ropes. There we go. Oh, come on. Why don't you why don't you quit it? Shooting your gosh dang tennis balls at me. Nope. Nope. I did not mean to long jump, I'm trying to backflip. Apparently easier set oh I didn't <laughs> I did not make my cloud into the requisite space that it wanted me to it was not within the perimeter oh, no. <laughs> oh man now we're gonna have to go back to the goo ah. oh never mind I forgot we made it through most of the goo it's a little concerned all right and I guess it doesn't technically use your final cloud, so you do get to hold on to that while you're trying to find more. Alright. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'm feeling fine. You get the clouds, of course, when you travel across. And here's my butt. Boop. Got him. Alright. So that was... Oh, everything is everything's horrible. Everything's horrible. Okay, so he's he's a little he's a little bit of a spicy boy. Oops, I forgot how to had a had a button for a moment. My brain got a little kind of my brain got a little confabulated. I like that he can see us, and he's just like, no, I don't like it when you do that. Okay, final form. This is the one that's going to be a little tricky. The Boomsday Machine has mobilized. You got to be really careful here. Ooh, there's so many star bits. I want to get them. And they're gone. It wasn't meant to be. Okay. So this one's a little tricky, too. You got to remember that uh, there's only so much height you can get. I'd like them to return. Okay. I don't think I needed a cloud refresh, but why not? Oh, my content's on the cloud. There we go. Okay. Let's see if we can get up there. Nope. <laughs> it would be nice if I could differentiate in my brain between ground pounding and spinning. But apparently, I cannot. If we get... Oh, we almost got him. Yes! For some reason, that was the easiest of the three stars today, and I don't 100% know why. Each star has taken a be, taken a be, taken me. I'm taking a beating to beat these off. So each star is taking about 10 minutes to beat to beat off, which isn't too bad, but you know. It was our first try, so we can always hang our hat on that. Mm. How about that, viewers? 
Once again, your help. Greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. Okay. And one final star. I actually kind of enjoy the the boss missions. Lava, how about you how about you back off? We're gonna do one more. We're gonna do another world six star. How about that? Um boo 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 boo. What sounds the least horrible? I'm trying to make sure I just even got everything. You know what? I deserve a I deserve a treat. I deserve this. After all my hard work, we're gonna get some silver stars in the Womp Fortress. Sometimes you need to treat yourself, viewers. With the theme of today's episode being all about mental health, treat yourself or else. So we're back for more nostalgia. Do do do. You know? Do you have anything useful to say? Great. Oh, so you did this. He's just trying to. He's a job creator. Kind of the opposite of the Guillermo. I always remember this being kind of um, one of my favorite early uh, early stars in Mario Galaxy. Nope, not Mario Galaxy. I mean, first off, everything I just said is 100% wrong. First off, this star does not exist in Mario Galaxy 1. It's in Mario Galaxy 2. It's not early. So, ignore everything I just said. It's one of my favorite early stars in Mario 64. It is a great... A great kind of tutorial stage, which I think is a lot of fun. Don't you call me that. I have a name, and it's Mario. Thank you. Yes. The music of this one is so iconic. Makes me very happy to kind of relive it. Ooh, this is... Uh, it's almost called that a star. That is not a star. We are having trouble using basic words, it appears. Okay. Nope. I keep thinking I'm still doing a daredevil run, so I'm kind of being extra cautious here. All right, where is the final one? So is it over there? Is it over? I see it. This one's a quick one too. It's a nice little treat, huh? Just like all of you viewers, you're all treats. Thanks for being you. Oh, great. <laughs> Guess they don't intend for this one to be the uh, the final one you get. So you're gonna be going on a bit of a treasure hunt. It's okay. Oops an opportunity to get more star bits. There's always a silver line in here to every cloud. Oof. Look at these goombers here. Let's just enjoy this for a moment. Just flapping around, being goombas, and get. This episode was going off the rails a little bit, but we brought it back. We held it together. We did every star on our first try. So thank you so much for that. You made quite the impact. We almost have a hundred stars. Amazing. Let's go ahead and deposit our earnings really quickly here. Yes. I don't know if there is another Hungry Luma. I would imagine that there's one additional Luma of hungriness to satiate. But we are not there yet. All right. So thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Mario Galaxy 2. And I'll see you next time. Bye.